Hello everyone that just joined. Today we are over here at Jerusalem Mill Village. Right here is the blacksmith shop. They're currently closed for renovations. We decided to come over here today because it was really nice out and hot. You know, just take a little walk through the woods here. This will, this is technically my third or fourth video that I've took since I've been here. Been having some problems with trying to upload the videos because I'm using a a um a selfie stick at the moment and having some problems for the audio. So I said screw all that. So I just have. Because I was trying to take pictures and take a video. But anyways, yeah. So now this would be like the third or fourth video. There's other videos that didn't have any sounds, so. Behind me again is the gift shop, and there's a little museum in there. I forgot. I tried to go and uh, take a picture, and I pressed on the thing, but I forgot the things out. There's a sign saying gunpowder, 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 gunpowder today. Ben Powder Falls State Park. Again, here in Top Maryland. If you haven't been here, welcome to visit. If you're a punk, I'm not saying it's worth taking a, a long drive to visit. But. And we're here at the Gunpowder State Forest Park at Jerusalem Mill. Here is the Mill Museum over here. Here's a. Um, a millstone? I'm not really sure what that's called, but... But, yeah, right through there, that door is a, a, a nice little new museum in there. It's pretty awesome. If you're ever in the area, you want to stop by. Jerusalem Mills, established in 1772 by David Lee, a Quaker from Bucks County, Pennsylvania. A gun manufacturer back of the mill furnished guns for the revolution in 1776. The original tract called Jerusalem was patented in 1687. And right back there, that is the little uh, building in the back there, that stone building. That's where they furnished the guns. Uh, that's where they made the guns back there. Now we're going to go across this bridge, go into the woods over here. Sorry if the video is a little shaky at the moment. Sorry about that. Time over here with my brother. Oh, look at the doggy. His channel is Jason's Journeys. Go and check him out. He also has a lot of exploring type 
videos and regular type of videos on this channel. And if anybody wants to come down here and uh, bring some fishing poles to fish down here, there's a lot of good uh, spots down here. Jerusalem Village. Coming up, um, it's actually, it'll be not this coming up Saturday, but the following Saturday, me and my brother, we're going to the Para Unity Con in New Jersey, and we're going to be um, meeting a lot of paranormal so liberties there and and also um checking out some local um uh paranormal groups that's that's there so i should have that video um up around like next Saturday or next Sunday. That will, and I'll have some videos there of me uh, meeting some of the celebrities there. Like um, Steve from Ghost Adventures. Um, Nicole from Paranormal Lockdown and Paranormal State, John Zaffis from The Haunted Collector, um, one of the guys from the Ghost Brothers will also be there. And um, also, me and with the main guy from the Tennessee Wraith Chasers, or as they're known as, their TV show is called 
coast uh, asylum. So yeah, and and also Amy Fooney from Coast Hunters from Taps. She, she'll also uh, be there as well, having so some pictures and videos with all those people there. So, look out for those videos next Saturday or Sunday. So, yeah, that should be a lot of fun. But yeah, as for today, we're over here at Gunpowder Fall State Park, to Riesel and Mill, just uh, enjoying this nice sunny day today, taking a walk through the woods. So, I'm going to try to record if I'm able to, or at least have some pictures. I'll do a side show, which I've done before. One or two of both, I'll have to see what I'm able to do. But like I said, that's on Saturday, May 19th, which is coming up, so you know it's a look forward to that video. Because I'll, I'll try to upload it. It's not the same day, but the next day. You know, I'll try to get my uploads uploaded quickly. Well, besides that, you know, we don't, I haven't been able to get out too much to do, you know, too many abandonments. It's not like I said, we're in LFR City. But hopefully, you know, soon, when the neighbor's here, when he has gifts, when he has time, and for weather permitting, it's always the big factor that screws everything up. <laughs> it's everyone can drive for that one. Is, you know, like I said, trying to get in the country city. It's a, probably next big explore. I'm going to to do that. Between that one and maybe the abandoned house is that's down towards the Ocean City, Maryland. I'm going to try for one. I don't know which one I'm going to try to do first. But, hopefully soon, but I don't like to give exact dates because I'm always walk through, so I'll let you know ahead of time to look out for it. We don't know if that's a mess, we're going to be able to get out to do a video at whatever location on the side of shoes. But like I said, meantime, just doing a nature walk right now. Again, this location is historic. Greenstone Mill Village in South Maryland. You can also do the... It is hot out. The historic Jericho Bridge. Jericho Covered Bridge. It's got a lot of history to it. Um, I have caused some training activity there years ago. I didn't make a video at the time, but I have a picture I have to locate. It was in 2009. It was on a summer day, so it wasn't like, you know, foggy out or anything. But I have took several pictures, and then one picture of Pasta Aparicio Serum on it. Um, but yeah, that's the full historic bridge. We recently renovated it. So that's really good. But yeah, this has a point to get this dislocation where we're at now. Like I said, any places that you suggest, like I'm up to looking for any places that possibly either Maryland or Pennsylvania or Delaware, if anything in Delaware, you know, different states, here in Maryland, Delaware, you know, you can give a description, if any place you want me to look at, I can see if I'm possibly getting to, I can't guarantee, but I'll see what I can do. And you know, I'm always up for ideas. I'm always brainstorming. It's just I'm not as I mean I don't upload as much as a lot of other other people do, but I try best to can. Yeah, we're gonna walk 
do our best to open the store. There's a couple of bread. If you do, you know, you know you stay or anything outdoors, whether you're not on the trail or not, I'm um, always keep a look out for ticks. <laughs> it's always a big factor. I hate those ticks. More so than the I mean, mosquitoes, of course, they're annoying too, but don't watch out for them. The ticks, they're just here. Ticks are a pain in the booty. There's the horse trail. Cover the bridge this way. Yeah, take like a nice day out, you know. And just get out and take advantage of the horse on. Alright, here soon, we're going to be walking over the historic Jericho covered bridge here. I'm going to try to do both, but I won't be the same exact time, so it all depends on when I'm able to get to first. My area in the edge of Maryland, Concord City is um, three hours away. So, it's going to be enough hour, oh, This is a very I'm old, covered uh, <laughs> bridge here. And now we are entering the historic coverage of the bridge. And, and it, it smells very old. <laughs> As you can hear though, water is underneath us. But right within this doorway, right within a, in a doorway, you know, a little bit right inside the few steps is where I caught that possible apparition. I know it was um, 2009. It was, I yeah, it right was the there, around that area, on the Jer Jericho Bridge, my brother caught, took a picture, and in the picture, you could make out like a, some kind of apparition, like a, some kind of, like a form there of a spirit. So, that was, uh. Pretty awesome. Nothing else happened, just that whatever appeared on that picture. But I don't know if you're not here or not. And a very long time ago, you go past that, uh, the bridge, and you keep going. There used to be a, uh, a little, a, uh, out factory. There's some kind of old, uh, there is a old, uh, factory that was past that, the Jericho Bridge, but since then it got tore down. Of course, that was a long time ago, so. Hopefully here soon, um, we'll be able to 